What's up, guys? Surfing Daddy Pops is here. Um, another mail call. Uh, this week was crazy. Did a video earlier, doing another one. This, um, I thought this was coming tomorrow, actually, so um, I'm going to dig into it right off the bat. Did some good ones. It was a find from a Facebook post. Uh, we connected. Gentleman looked like he was selling some stuff. We were talking about lot buys and stuff like that. Great conversation. We were just having fun with it. He shared some stuff, and I said, I'd be interested in this stuff and that. I did already have a few of the commons that he had, but he wanted to um, finish up his uh, selling of his collection. Um, looks like he collects different stuff, autographed helmets and stuff like that into the sports line. So I think he was just getting rid of the pops, which is fine. Um, he had a few that were interest of mine for sure. And basically I paid $55 shipped for that box. Uh, this box that I'm gonna get a share right now, there's six pops in it. So 11, 12 bucks a piece. But then I'm gonna tell you the values. So. Uh, some are going to stay as personal, even if they're only 10 or 12 bucks. And the other ones, I'm going to sell. So the box, solid. I already opened it. I didn't dig through it, and I can show you. Um, it's not like a mystery box or anything like that. Um, I already knew how he shipped it. He showed me. It's just peanuts and stuff, so I'm going to keep it on the floor and just do one by one. Because um, he shared what he did. Um, great packing. It's a little different. Um, he put like a... There's no sorters or anything like that. I already saw it as I was a little nervous, but the box is super solid, so I'm not gonna be nervous at all. I'm just gonna go one at a time. I just don't want the peanuts all over the floor so my dogs get a hold of them. Um, a little bit of a theme on some. We got a little bit of the rocks line. Um, I had this particular person at first when they first came out. I'm kind of getting away from the rocks line um, until the Lincoln Park thing comes out, and that's over and done with. I do have some MCR pops. Uh, my, my Chemical Romance, um, that whole set's like 250 bucks, but I think I'm time to sell that. Um, just a common, Queen. That was a good one. Hard to find a little bit. FYE always has them. Um, that was part of the, the rest of them. Again, he's only um, 10 or 11 bucks. Oh, this one does have a protector, but I think it's the only one that does have a protector. Um, that's actually pretty cool. Continuing that, Rock's Line, Queen. That's... Um, Roger Taylor. This one right here actually is 30 bucks. So remember what I paid for the box. 55 Shipped. I gave him a few extra bucks. He's already giving me a good deal. I don't want to cover any fees. He didn't care. He's like, oh, that's right. They were listed like eight bucks a piece. Um, take them all. So he was definitely getting, I just was able to handpick some stuff. Next up, the third one, Brian May. Again, any Queen fan would probably have the, the whole band. There's five total. On the back. Again, I do not own any of these. But I was just helping them out because I didn't need a lot of the commons. And I was like, you know what? If you're going to sell them, I'll take those as well. So I was cherry picking them for sure. Um, that one's around uh, 20 bucks right there. So that set was already 51 60 bucks, And I paid 55 shipped. Next up. Three more. This one's, These are the three that I actually wanted to begin with. So... For the price point, I was like, oh my gosh, this guy. Um, holy crap. It's a weird bottom on this one. Check it out. Spock. This thing's killer. I'm a Star Wars fan, not a Star Trek fan. However, can't go wrong with uh, Spock, the original one. Pretty sure this was... Oh, there's nothing on the bottom. That was weird. Um, epic Pose. Great box. 2013, I think. Hmm, I'm gonna look into that more. Either way, 22 to $23. Another one, I already have the chase. This is just the common. Still a good one, it was hard to find. He's only worth 10 or 12 bucks. There's a little damage right there. But again, he's a common. I'll just put him next to the chase version. Um, or keep them behind. I do have the John Wick with the dog, which is right there, actually. Ding, ding. So, cool, 10, 11 bucks. And the last one, one of my first bloody variants of this particular one from FYE, but it's the common version of William Wallace from Braveheart. This sucker right here is going for $35 to $42, I think. Uh, box is in really good condition. 
think there's a crease. Oh, a little crease on the back, a little corner. But killer. I do not have that common. And um, July 2017. Pretty solid. Love that movie. So good. And the other one is... Oh, right up top. Here, I'll grab it. Same exact pop. The exclusive from FYE, they called him Chases back then, is bloody. You can see he's got the blood splatter all over his face. But same exact pose and mold. Man, that's cool. So good finds. So again, $55. Yeah, 55 Shipped in a killer box. And I think the totals, give or take, I think they fluctuated a little bit. 60 to 82, 85, 95, 96, 97, 140 bucks, 135 bucks. It's crazy. And um, he wants me to buy the rest of them too, but those are the finds you can get. And um, again, some are personal, some will sell. He just has trouble selling them, he just wants them done. So again, that was $55 shipped. Um, killer deal, six pops. Average was 11, 12 bucks a piece. And basically I got $140 out of it. Um, value, I'm not gonna get that. I'm gonna keep some, so. Um, those are the good finds, man. It's killer. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Take a peek at it. There's always finds out there. If you're the um, pop collector, you never know. Um, so take a look. Hope you guys enjoy. Surfer Daddy pops out. Later.